the action figure gods continue to bless us by giving us more great Star Wars action figures. Today on the channel, we are going to be taking a look at the Star Wars Black Series 40th Anniversary Jedi Knight Luke Skywalker. Now, I did not get the past Luke Skywalker because he just looked like a grown baby. I did not like the head sculpt, so I just opted out on not getting a figure. Having faith that eventually Hasbro would make another version of that, a better version of that. And as we can see, my faith in the action figure gods has continued to pay off. As you can see, you get a nice shell packaging. You know, it's a nice card with a nice uh, classic Kenner card back. Looks great. Great for you collectors who prefer to keep your action figures in the box. Or if you want to take your one out of the box and buy another one to keep in the box, you can also do that. And, you know, it definitely looks nice. It'll look nice on the wall sitting there. You get the other figures on the packaging. It's a really nice packaging. But, you know, I want to get this guy out of the box as soon as possible so we can take a look at it. So without further ado, let me get this guy out and stay tuned for the review. This is like one of the easiest reviews that I'm going to ever have to do in my life because this figure is just basically an all back figure. It's not a bad thing. It's, it's the suit. It's accurate, you know, but it's just an all black figure. I like what I'm seeing, though. I like the, the wrinkles that are going throughout the suit. The head sculpt on the action figure is really good. Again, the reason why I didn't pick up the OG Jedi Luke Skywalker is because the face was just so poorly done. I couldn't get past it, so I just opted out of it. But on this guy, the face is great. I also bought the old Luke Skywalker that was in the Ahsoka, no, so, excuse me, that was in the Mandalorian series. And I compared the faces to see if they were the same heads or not. The heads are the same. To my eyes, they are the same. This head sculpt being a little bit lighter than the other one, but for sure what is different is the hair piece. The, the hair piece on, the, on that Luke Skywalker was a lot cleaner, a lot more put together. This head sculpt, this hair piece is more all over the place, a little bit more uh, messy, you see? And it also has a lot more coloring in it. I, I, I really do like the, the, the coloring that is going on in the hair piece. You know, the eyes are, are really uh, baby blue, very noticeable. I like it. So as far as accessories go, he comes with his lightsaber that you can pull apart and there's a clip on the belt and you can just have the lightsaber resting on the belt if, if you so choose to do that. And as far as his other accessory, he comes with the, this black piece, which is his chest piece that you can switch out. Um, let me show you real quick. So you can switch out this chest piece from the flap out to the flap in and just have it be, hold on, let me get it. Boom, there we go. Yeah, that's that's how, yeah, you can have it, again, like I said, flap out or flap in, whichever choice you want. Flap out is cool to me because I feel like it just breaks up uh, the monotonous, uh, the monotony of black that's just going on with this suit. I'll just give it a little bit more, um, something you know so but for you it may be the other way around i don't blame you either way is a good way but i just prefer the the suit with the with the flap out you know now as far as articulation goes this guy's fun this guy is really fun to pose now his head is on a ball joint luke skywalker man hasbro is coming up because luke skywalker has butterfly joints man hell yeah finally how long has it been you know, since we've been asking for butterfly joints on our Marvel Legends and Star Wars Black series and we're finally getting it, doesn't matter as long as we're getting it. You know what I'm saying? It's better late than never. Always remember that, guys. Better late than never. He comes, he has a, a hinge at the elbow. He can also rotate at the elbow. 
He has a hinge at the wrist and can rotate at the wrist. At the, the waist is on a ball joint, so he can, you know, go around the world, you know? And the hips can go out, the legs can go forward, backwards. Well, not backwards, but, you know, back to the side like that, you know? Because, you know, the butt is in the way. He got a long butt, so it's like he can't really, like, put his... He, he, can't, he can't bring his leg back, you know? <laughs> long butt, that's funny. But um, anyways... Yeah, he got a, a hinge at the knee. He can rotate at the knee. A hinge at the ankle. And there is ankle pivot. So, yeah, this guy is a really, really must-have action figure in your Star Wars collection. No cap. No questions about it. This is a, a top-notch action figure that, for any Star Wars fan, is a must-have in your collection. You know what I'm saying? Go out and get him. Order him right now. Well, after you get done watching the video, of course, go order him because, you know, he's a great figure, you know? Uh, as far as size comparisons, I did do that, and that was really fun to get this guy posed around some of his buddies, some of his rivals, and, you know, just messing around with them. I tried to get a little bit more creative uh, with the poses than I usually am because you know, I, I prefer just the, the, the stagnant um, Well, not stagnant, but what's the word I'm looking for? I just prefer like a regular Museum pose type of you know look for my action figures, but um Yeah, guys, this is I can't put this figure over enough it, 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 It's a, a must-have piece and we are getting closer and closer and closer to getting a redone episode three, Anakin Skywalker. We're getting an updated version of it. I know it's coming real soon. The action figure gods have been blessing me and you so far, and I have faith that they're gonna continue to do so. I'm telling you, in the next couple of months, I feel it. We're gonna get a reveal of episode three, Anakin, and episode three, Obi-Wan. And you best believe they gonna be reviewed on this channel. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you liked it, please subscribe, share it, get the get me out there. You know what I'm saying? If you like the content. Uh, but yeah, post your comments in the comment section below. Let's have the discussion. And I will see you on the next video. Peace out. I'm gone, guys.